Samsung should be five to six months away from unveiling the Galaxy Z Flip 5. While Samsung continues to be the leader in the foldable smartphone market, it is trying to consolidate its position by introducing new models in this area. The Flip 5 has just popped up in an online benchmark, revealing some impressive performance levels even compared to the Galaxy S23 Ultra. As it is known, Samsung used the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for Galaxy chip in the S23 series. This chip was significantly faster than the regular Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. It seems that this chip will also be used in the Z Flip 5. The benchmark confirms that the Flip 5 SMF731U is powered by the very same chipset as the S23 series, namely the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for Galaxy, which boasts a higher frequency for the primary super core of 3.36 instead of 3.2 GHz. But despite this similar hardware, the upcoming Flip 5 leave the Galaxy S23 Ultra in the dust, particularly in terms of this benchmark's single core tests. This is great news for users who are looking for a high-end phone that can handle demanding applications and multitask with ease. The Galaxy Z Flip 5 scored a little over 2,000 points in single-core tests and reached a 52-13 multi-core score. Indeed, Samsung's upcoming foldables don't have a plus variant of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 but rock the overclocked for Galaxy chipset. The clamshell foldable is equipped with 8 gigs of RAM and also boots Android 13 according to the listing. In contrast, the Galaxy S23 Ultra, SMS 918B, Scores around 1,500 points in the single-core tests and anywhere between 4,400 and 5,000 points in multi-core tests. So although multi-core performance might be similar between the S23 series and the upcoming Flip 5, the fifth-generation foldables have somehow scored considerably higher in single-core benchmarks using essentially the same hardware as 23. Meanwhile, it is expected to offer a stunning display, a powerful camera system, and an innovative folding mechanism. It is set to be game-changer in the smartphone industry. With the impressive performance levels, innovative design, and cutting-edge features, it is sure to attract a lot of attention from both consumers and tech enthusiasts alike. It will be interesting to see how Samsung's competitors respond to this new challenge from the Korean tech giant. So how do you like these new benchmark results? Let us know it down below in the comment section, and if you enjoyed the video, then a sub to the channel will be massive, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you for the next time. Peace out.